Hello everybody. Today's tip has to do with DMX and moving heads in particular. Uh, this works well with weddings especially and corporate events as well. Uh, if you're having cocktail hour and dinner hour and so forth like that, um, uplighting is, is appropriate naturally. However, moving heads that are going to shine on somebody, mm, not so much. I have created a scene that is in every show that I do and I named it Don't Blind Grandma. Typically they'll be seated up front as guests of honor. Uh, let's say it's even a corporate event. You'll, you don't want to uh, have moving heads, especially as bright as they are these days, uh, hitting them in the eye. So what I've done is I've created an aerial, which I'll show you a clip of. And all it does is slowly sweeps like it's a Hollywood premiere style all across the ceiling. It gives a very nice, elegant look because they're moving so slow. It adds a, that, that little extra special something to the event. Like we, we, we're somebody special. We're somewhere special. And it never shines in their eyes. The other programs that I do have for later during a dance portion, they will be aimed at the dance floor. But the main point is, don't blind grandma. And here's what it looks like. So there you have it, two elegant looks that create a great dance floor, wonderful photo opportunities. If you noticed in the foreground of the second clip, there's a young lady sitting at a table actually singing along to the song. And another thing you don't know that you will, you should notice is there are no dots on these people it makes for great photo opportunities so i encourage you whatever program you choose whatever platform you choose as far as dmx goes it's worth the investment you can get into it for as little as four hundred dollars and there's wonderful videos on youtube that you can learn this and just practice 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 like you practice mixing and you will be able to create some programs like that and aim your lights up. If you noticed, even the par lights are aimed up towards the ceiling so that I'm getting the ceiling bounce that are lighting the dancers up and actually lighting the whole room. So you don't get that uh, truck lights in the eye effect that Brian talks about. It gives, it provides eye candy for people that are looking on the dance floor at, or at the booth, but they're not getting blinded, but everybody's lit up. So that's my tip of the day. Don't blind grandma. Don't blind anybody. Go out there, have a good time, practice and enjoy.